Okay, and now we are recording. So, uh, yeah, this is the third time I'm playing Lost in Random. We're going to go ahead and get started. We have three of them here. Last time we played, uh, we were trying to help the triplets of Freedom uh, solve their civil war. Basically, what this amounted to was a lot of going back and forth and not being able to access certain areas and stuff like that. Uh, I think I was going the other way. We also have a few missions in here. Okay, so three's a crowd. Uh, besides the objects, uh, to, uh, yeah. Then Three Ring Circus. Yeah. And then Sisters Under Skin. So I have to find the Sister Underground as well. So don't know where that is. I thought it was where we first started. But, oh yeah, I forgot the war! Guys, that was funny. Oh, hey, it's you. So, hey. I've met the Baroness. You have? Describe her to me. War hungry. She's the scariest woman you've ever seen. That's even before you notice her dress is made out of cannons. I didn't notice her dress is made out of cannons. She's tough. She doesn't tolerate fools. I kind of really like her. She's like a drill instructor who teaches drill instructors how to be even meaner d drill instructions. I'm going to say the second one. I can see why. Thank you for this. It will enhance my stratagems for sure. Alright, I've met the Duke. You have? Describe him to me. Uh, he, like the laziest person you ever met was somehow also the most powerful person you ever met, true. He wants to experience every aspect of life to the fullest, and honestly, I can't fault him for that. He's soft and cuddled, and I'm amazed he lasted as long as he has, but he inspires loyalty. I'm gonna say that one. That's our Duke. Thanks. All this information helps my strategies become even more unstable. So that's all tr three of the triplets. And it's been educational. They all seem to be stuck in the same chaotic squabbling road they have had since they were children. Nanny was wise to order me not to take any sides. I see that now. Here, I would like to give you a token of my appreciation with my thanks. And... All right, a reward. Acid Cannon. Ooh. An old cannon from the No Dice Wars uh, enters the game shooting acid arrows. It is removed. Nice. That actually is kind of cool. Okay. So, I understood from them being underground, kind of being in this area. Because this is underground, right? Yeah, so this is This is definitely underground here, right? I can't think of anywhere else I can go that's underground around here. Okay. Sorry, wrong button. <sighs> Finding ourselves even decided to find those missing scissors among the teapots in the trenches and underground. Yeah. Am I supposed to do something to bring one out? I guess it can't be here then. No, it's not really related to the main story, but it's going to drive me crazy if I don't figure out where it is. Oh, maybe it's in that little hole where the, the Duke is. Or not the Duke. The Baron? Yeah, the Baron. Because there was a space right before... Oh, 
I'm gonna... Is everyone just gone now? Okay, these are the trenches. The Count Domain. Okay. It's the Count. I said the Baron. No, it's a Baroness. Baroness, Count, and Duke. Hello, Laika. Welcome to the chat. Welcome to Lost in Random. We're continuing... This game, trying to find the three sisters, which I know is a weird sentence, but. What I mean by that is we have a mission where we are attempting to find three sisters that are hiding about somewhere in this level. I forgot I could sprint. So, this is underground, right? No, she's not here either! Okay, it looks like I'm going to walk through this entire level. Okay. And also, it lets me get some more money. Nice arm waggle on that sprint. Yeah. Okay, so what I need to be looking for is a way to get underground. That's the main concern right now. And I've been to two places I thought were underground, but apparently either not underground enough or not the correct underground. Just. I don't think this is underground. This just. Yeah, this is definitely not underground. Nostalgium. All right. Because, yeah, it was told that it was supposed to be one in the trenches, and that's where I am right now. Here we are in the Duke's Domain. It's not really anything underground about this area, right? Alright. All right, wild card hill, the Baroness is... Well, I mean, there's only one direction to go. Oh. It's this guy again. Even... Did you... Forget about me? No. Child. She's not coming. Well, that's mean. Oh, he can't hear you. And soon, he won't hear anything ever again. I'm working as fast as I can. Not really. Are you? I've kind of... Because from where I'm lurking, all I see is you playing detective and wasting Bernard's time. Okay, both of those are simultaneously true. 
Okay. Oh, am I underground here? Is this underground? I accidentally just shot her in the eye. All right. Hello, Eben. I wasn't expecting to find you here. Your sister is looking for you. You've done well to find me, Eben. I know my sisters appreciate it. I do. I'm to go to the safe spot by the sword bridges. Then you're to join us, and we're to give you something, right? Yep. Actually, yeah. How did you know that? Is this sort of prank? How do you know this stuff? I'm gonna say that one. Because I know you, Eben. And I hope I will see you again. Alright. Oh, hey, look at that. There's also a, uh... Hidey hole. Oh, that kind of looks once you've done all three of the, uh, domains... That... Everything is opened up. Oh! Oh, no, wait, I haven't gone here yet. Oh, is that the, uh, the weapon? Uh, what? Wasn't expecting something to happen there. Indeed, Rar. Yeah? Hey, you said butt. Hi. Alright. I know who that is. What do you want? You sound like an AI artist. Give me my sister back. Yeah. Okay, so give my sister back. Seems like you have too many. Am I either gonna... I didn't. Yeah, most uh, people in these types of settings do. Okay. Uh, I'm even you, witch. <laughs> I like that. Nothing can stop me from saving her. I'll never give up. Never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. Okay, I'm going to say the second one. If you can't count them all, how do you know they all fell? Uh-oh. Shouldn't have mentioned that part. Uh-oh. Nope. It was honestly... Should have ended the conversation... Well before that. All right. Murder weapon. Okay, now I have to return to Nishka. Also, I have to get to the sword. 
Oh, hey, Manny Dex. Alright. Yeah, the, the trenches, the Duke's Domain. No, wait, the Duke's Domain is where I came from. It would be the Count's Domain that I... Haven't gone to it. Sword Bridges. Yeah, this is where I want to go. Sword Bridges. Yeah, now that you've pointed it out, Phil, I can't help but notice that Even's uh, arms are, like, twice as long as they should be. All right. Seven Bridges. Hey, it's you. Wait, where are the other sisters? <laughs> even now, you don't dare ask the question you most want answered, even. It's okay. We all work within the systems we're trapped in. I thank you for your help. You found us and helped us, and nothing lasts forever. What? I'm sorry, even. I know this isn't the ending you wanted. I know I'm broken. I know I can't be fixed. But now, I can rest. Are you a ghost? Are you sister's ghost? Are you your sisters? Uh, I'm gonna say the first one. For what it's worth, I hope you find Odd even. And when you do, I hope she's not like me. Even. There are three heads you need to be careful of. But they're not the triplets you think they are. What? You have so much pain ahead of you. What? I promised you a gift. This is all I can give you. A dead girl. Hoping with all her heart that your lost sister won't share her fate. Yeah, okay, so you are a ghost. You could have said yes to that question. Uh, reward. Date of hate. D8 of hate. Summon a threatening octahedron that, when shot or hit, explodes and hurts any nearby beings. It is removed from play after 30 seconds. Uh, not that great, but... something he wanted to say what of course i like you dicey i like you an awful lot dicey what would make you ever wonder of course i like you why would you ask we both cause dangerous things that happen it's not just you i don't care if i if you don't know your past i know who you are now my friends we're helping people remember that you're strong but not scary you're good that doesn't mean you're a monster i'm gonna say the third one we're helping people. Remember that. You're not... That's what I just said. <laughs> Moving those statues just because you can do things others can't doesn't mean you're bad. I think it's impressive, not scary. You've got so much potential. You see that, right? I'm going to say that one. If you want the truth, then yes, I admit. I for, oh, Dicey, I think you're like family, too. Uh, honestly, I think you meet some family when you're born, and others you meet later on. Yep, really, you and me, dicey against random. I'm gonna say the first one. Okay. Interesting. Uh, and the camera flipped me around. Yeah, Burton-esque. This whole game is Burton-esque. I think I've mentioned that before. We've had some characters that just seem straight up like Mayor of Halloween Town or Jack Skellington and stuff like that. Okay. What were we talking about again? Here's where we get all the answers. I've been to the Duke. He gave me this portrait. Oh, that portrait of the children, the triplets, and their father, their poor father, the king, killed, killed while I, while he, I, I can't remember. I need more, more objects to jog my poor memory. It's weird that you have what? know exactly how many objects are needed. Uh, Baroness gave me your old arm. My arm. I remember. I wore this. I used this to help defend the king when he, on that night when he, but then it, oh, it's gone. It's gone. Please yeah, Shadow Man is... Objects. I can feel it. We also had in the in the last world uh, Royam who straight up looked like what Oogie Boogie. Like the the knit burlap sack. By the dice maker. I remember this. It came 
over us so quickly, so savage. We couldn't... Oh, it's on the tip of my tongue and then it's gone. It, I'm sorry, even. What were we talking about? The murder weapon. The night the king died. Well, I'm afraid I need to jog my memory. Please bring me more objects. No, that's... You have all the objects. What? That's all of them. Now, can you remember who were... Okay, so I I needed to bring her all the objects and then tell her I brought the objects. Hey, bell ringing. That means something good. All right. Okay, yeah, her dress is a cannon. Oh wow, there's cannons in that cannon. Oh, what? Well, he was just standing right there? He was just standing right there? He's not supposed to be able to stand right there. She's not wrong. Well, we have Bernard. Thanks for the outfit, Bernie. Do you think you'll be okay now? Sure thing. I can find my way home to one cross with my eyes closed. Easy peasy. Don't worry, even. I'll make sure he gets home. And good luck to you. Uh... I'm not good at goodbyes. Say hi to Odd. Oh, I almost forgot. Wait. You like the pips, right? This is all that was left of Mr. Shady when you pooped him. Weird, huh? Oh, <laughs> thank you. Hey, hey guys. All right. No, okay, so I can't go back to Two Town. Who's going to put the pips on? Oh. Uh, Rule Master's bow. Hey. Reward the dice pips. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so I don't have anything else to do around here. What's over here? Oh, this is just a path back into freedom. Uh, why is your arm gone again? That was incredible. Ah, the real shame was that I was lost for so long. But you, you found me even. And the war that's torn apart this family is finally over. You did good even, but you need to move on. I have the feeling other people need you. All right. I'll miss you, and Niska. I'll miss you. What did you say your name was, little girl? I'm just having some fun with you, even. Now go. Ah. Uh, Nishka has things she needs to do. All right. Well, I guess we're just gonna go on then. Well, what the hell? You guys saw the 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 ramp disappear for a moment there, right? Oh, there it is. Oh, hey. So apparently with Dicey standing in a 
Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Weird. Okay. Let's get on. I'm surprised we didn't have to fight the Shadow Man. Don't fight the Shadow Man! Alright. How many times have I made a uh, can't find a better man joke? Alright. So, are we just skipping over 4 and 5 and going straight to 6? I can't tell if she's actually fooled them or if some just don't care. Get aboard the gondola. Yeah, I can still shoot things. Now I'm dressed like a six. The spider gondola. Are you happy here? I'm full of candy here, so yes. I'm going to save us all. I'm going to save my sister. Without candy? How are you going to save anyone without candy? Do you have candy? We had lots of candy in Five Tropolis, but not anymore. No, I don't have candy. How are you going to save anyone without candy? What the f What? <laughs> I, I feel like there's a logic there that I'm just not following. Someone whoa, Bernie, what's wrong with your face? You uh somehow look uglier. That's a funny way. Oh, you look so um thank you. It's a compliment in the upside downtown. Where are you from, Bernie? Uh yes, this is Bernard. Hey, Bernie, I figured uh, they'd find you sooner rather than lady. Are you excited uh, for where we're going? It's anywhere is better than hope. They're kidnapping us. Nah, they're rescuing us. That's what they said. And you uh, humans can't lie, can you? Well. Oh, no. All right. Hey, Dicey. Oh, shoot, that's cool. Okay. Oh, I'm controlling Dicey. I can't tell if this is the first time that's happened. <sighs> nice. Double button. Hey, Dicey! Many Dex, how the fuck did you get here? How how the fuck did you get here? All right, let's get. Oh man, the Shadow Man's touch. Let's uh buy the lance. Oh, cheat or hazards? Let's go with the hazard. Okay, we'll add those to the shop. All right. Wow, we have uh, only four more card packs to go. Okay, I have $300. Let's... Let's buy these triplet bombs. Step one, summon three bombs. Step two, shoot to activate. Three, enjoy the fireworks. All right, and then 125. I might as well get this. Sonic Bloob. 
Uh, some of the dreaded blue of the shriek uh, breaks all nearby crystals. It is Oh, that's actually pretty good. I like it. Let's go ahead and see what we have here. Lucky draw. Quick draw. Crystal curse. Those are all too good. Dice Wielder's Boon. Time Warp. Time Warp. Maybe not. Uma's Embrace is all right. Have you seen the real-life Karn... I heard that there was a Karnov movie. Let's take out the... Hand and... Yeah, let's... And let's take out the Lance. Uh, let's complete the deck more. Oh, nope. Not what I meant to do. Okay. I could put the time... I, I like the idea of putting the bloob in play. Uh, I already have two of the Crystal Curse, right? Yeah. So I don't want another one. What's this? Randomly alter the cost of the card to either... No, no, that's too much. I could put... Uh... Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, no, I haven't seen that. Uh, acid cannon. Yeah, I, I said earlier that sounds pretty cool. So let's put the acid cannon in. All right, let's continue. All right. A uh, Soviet soldier card calling. Hello? And the puppies and kittens have cookies? Yes. Oh, yes. That's a very happy thought. Thank you. If I fill my head with happy thoughts... There will be no room for sad thoughts about reality. My mom's <laughs> <laughs> during the war. The big one. I miss her so much. I thought this would be fun. But. But. Lemonade on a hot day. Getting tucked into bed. A nice warm blanket on a cold night. I'm scared too. That makes me feel a bit better. Do you have any happy thoughts? Uh, I think about a future better than today. I think about how great things are going to be once I save my sister. I think about fixing, well, I'll just, I'm going to go with the sister one. Things being better forever. That's a happy thought. Things being better forever. With ice cream and puppies and hugs and moms and dads and families and cookies and kittens. And cookies shaped like kittens and made out of ice cream. All right. So there's lots of uh, gems here, so I'm thinking there's a fight about to happen. Probably against her. I heard they have unicorn ponies in Six Town. Okay, she said uniponies, or they said I I don't know their gender. Uh, they said unicorn ponies, but the text just said uniponies. I heard they have robot buddies in Six Town, and everyone gets a robot buddy, and you can buzz around your robot buddy. All right, Laika, thanks for stopping by and saying hi. I heard the queen has her own magical dream world. All right. All right, we're talking. What are you doing here? Where are you doing here? Same as yourself. I don't think so. I'm Nanny's favorite, so that makes me the most important kid. You fully drink the Kool Aid. Well, okay, well, good for you. It is good for me. I always knew I was a sixer, and finally, the rest of the world is acting like it. Honestly, some of the kids here, you can put them in a sixer uniform, but you can't change who they are. And wait a minute, Evan. Evan! It's me, Lucky from One Town. What are you doing here? How did it take you that long to notice? Shh, I'm here to save us. I'm not doing anything sneaky. You clearly are. What's going on? Wait a second. You're not even 12 yet. You're too young to be here. You're an imposter. Lucky, listen. No, you listen, even. I roll the quiz dice to get here, and you're... You're a cheater. You don't belong here. You're an imposter. You're an imposter. Sus! It's like Among Us. It's like Among Us. Hi. A dice? Where did you find them? Tell me. Up your butt. You tell me where my sister is, you witch. Oh. <laughs> Your other sister, Auntie 
How do you know which one I was talking about? Hey, that's the Spider-Man movie. Okay. Yep, I'm gonna have to fight the nanny. She doesn't have any spots for me to, uh... There we go. Let's throw that. Okay, so I have two. Well, I only need this one. This is the sword. This one I can't even use right now. So let's use this for shield and put a pin in the other two and then... Yeah, I don't think you did ask me mean and ask me nice. Ow. Did I not get anything from that? Alright. We're good enough there. Okay, so this is definitely good. We're using this. Uh, acid Cannon or Crystal Curse. Crystal Curse is always better. Let's uh, put a pin in the Acid Cannon. And then, speaking of Crystal Curse. Oh man, more rhyming. All right, full hand. Oh, a lot more people here than I expected. All right, uh, we're definitely going for more quick draw. Uh, acid cannon, hell yes. Let's put it right in the middle of the room. And that's it. Uh, I'm going to keep the time one. And then let's get the nanny a bit more. And that's all I can really do. Ow! That hurt. Alright. Okay. Three, perfect. Let's reduce the cost of everything and not even need that three. Sword of threes. We're gonna slow down time right here. And... I don't know. Let's just put it around here somewhere. All right, that was actually a fair chunk of damage. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice. All right. Hey, another acid cannon. What else? Hey, crystal curse. Keep that going. Oh, and that was it. Okay, well, we're going to keep the crystal cannon and we're going to keep the yelly thing. Oh. There we go. Oh, handful. Okay, lucky draw goes. Uh, time or acid cannon? Let's get the time going and let's get this guy going. And we're gonna put him right here. 
Oh, I don't have any way of attacking. I should have gone for the acid. Oh. Okay, cool. Good. Good, good, good. Crystal curse. Sword. Double the sword. And an acid gun, just for good measure. Well, don't miss. You can scream and you can shout, but Nanny will eat your bones and snout. I'm not doing too bad in this fight. Oh. Well, uh, Nanny decided the fight was over. Oh no! Oh, well, we need to go after Dicey now. Here, take my hand. Uh oh, that's the queen. Well, Lucky is irredeemable now. I mean, to be fair, she was right. It's probably for the best. Because uh, she needs to find Dicey again. Oh, hey, that removed the costume. That was Lucky. It removed the costume, and that's all it did. See, it's moments like this. Like, look at how good this game looks right here. Ah, that looks so good. Like, it perfectly mixes its stylization with everything. Oh, more stairs. Okay. Whew, I thought uh, the stairs were over for a moment. More stairs. Yep. What? You're using words I don't understand. I'm less than 12 years old. Royam could not rhyme that well. This, uh, this, that makes me think this is a dream of some kind. Oh, wow, one person completed a rhyme on their own. Death and ruin for those who oppose. As went the sister, so the whole world goes. This is all foreboding and uh, ultimately not really telling me much. But it's giving a very spooky attitude. Ah. Interesting. Okay, well, yeah, Lucky, uh, Lucky kind of earned that, I guess? Even you, 
she had to find her missing friend. Yep. She gathered her courage, squared her shoulders, and... And I just want to go home. <sighs> and realized that she just wanted to go home. Oh, but home was very far away. She had no idea how to get there. I wonder if the narrator's going to turn out to be like a character or something like that. Oh, hey! Lost in Random is the title of this mission. Okay, I'm moving so slowly. You cannot do this to me, game. You cannot do this to me, game. By the way, this is clearly the part of the hero's journey that's like the fall. Whatever you want to call it. Oh man, I almost uh, was able to run there for a moment. Oh hey, there's a well. Well, what do we have here? Okay. Nope, that didn't actually do anything. Oh, there's more of those spider things. Yeah, definitely a good game to be playing in October. Yep. All right. Uh, I don't know why the sudden stutter there. That was weird. Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, that skill. No, 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 no. I don't know exactly where I'm going, but I'm assuming this door frame is a good place to uh, head towards. Okay, yep, that's uh, scary. Ow. Okay, she's dead. She got a couple of rocks right upside the head. Way... That is definitely some type of concussion. Oh, and can't even found herself approaching the edge of Forberg, or rather, the silent remains of that once glorious city. Yeah, four town ruins. The queen had torn it to pieces during the war years ago in her mad search for something. The only trace of it at all were the ruined and lifeless stones shrouded in fog. Lost to memory. Memory. Right, well, I guess I'll just keep following the path. There's, I can't do anything else, so it's not like. Oh, hey. To even it was like an impossible vision, something she could scarcely believe. A rebuilt fort town. Squatting Neat. by the ruins of what came before, a city without history, but who called it home? Well, there's a carnival going on. <laughs> Forget everything! Ferris wheel! I know that's not actually what's going on, I just... It amused me to think of that. Those were also very steep steps. You know, okay, so here's the thing. I haven't seen the the Vagabond since the first chapter, so let's see if he's involved in this somehow. Sweet, door opened. There's no one behind it. To what? Hey, what the? Oh, you cheated me! Prove it! Ain't no law 
Foreman. Yeah, foreigners. All right, well, absolutely heading in there to see if that's dicey. You gotta. What manner of destruction will it unleash upon these fighting grounds? What rules and norms will it tear asunder as its true power is finally unleashed? There's only one way to find out. <laughs> when I roll them bones. Why isn't it doing anything? Come on, give it a kick. <laughs> Worthless. Dicey. No. I'm not leaving here without you, Dicey. Leave him alone. This dice is under my protection. Ah, <laughs> a fine job you've been doing of it too. But I am always tough. Yeah, see, when it's in cutscenes like that, the lips actually match. Alright, survive the foreman. Alright, that should be... Oh my god, that's a big one. All right, reducing everything's cost and perfect. One, two, and oh, what? No, I don't have enough for that. Son of a bitch. Yeah, it doesn't seem like a good place over here. Ow. Okay, let's throw that again. A hey, better sword. And that's all I got. Okay, let's heal up next time and also get this. Ow. There we go. <laughs> Alright, what do we got here? Yeah, we definitely need to make it easier to get higher numbers. And we also need to heal. And I also want time to slow down here so that I can get some good hits in. And let's get this one. You're not a challenge. You're a joke. Ow. Oh. Full hand. Let's go. I don't know why they keep uh, saying things like uh, that I have no chance and stuff like that because I'm actually doing pretty well right now. Yeah, see, like, I took down the largest. Garbage back. Yes, and he's not gone. 
garbage. Again, I was doing pretty well. And the pips are following me. Yeah, of course he's not dead. Oh, Dicey. I'm not even sure how he's living in the first place. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to get you hurt. I should have never put you in danger. We don't belong here, and I just, I just want to go home. Did someone say smuggle me home? Who the hell are you? Because you, Ludo Betts, are in the presence of Ludo Betts. The greatest person smuggler in all of random. Is, is, your, is your name based on the game Ludo? Aren't you a little young to be a smuggler? I could ask you the same thing. Let's just say I'm old enough to be great at it and young enough that nobody suspects me. You see, I've got my bag. Top of the line, nothing so fine, purely benign. What makes your bag so special? It's bigger on the inside. Me and my brother can fit anyone inside. Uh, well, I'm sorry, I mean, I can. My brother, Bruno, I lost him to the high roller. Oh, no. Who I'm betting you know. Is it, is it the four? He lost, and now he owns him. And you, well, you've got yourself a real dice, which means you have a real chance to free Bruno. Do that, and I'll be real motivated. To All right, once him. again, we're doing favors for people. Dicey and I just fought him and we lost. Because yeah, that seems right. You don't have enough pips. Any fool can see that. Look, the high roller seems all high and mighty, but he's got a weakness. It's in his name. Roll a higher number than his, and he'll lose everything. Just Why dice uh, butt now? Uh, he's already beaten. Yeah, I just want to go home. Oh, sure. Good luck with that. Without me to guide you, you'll be lost and eaten in hours. Right, I gotta Fix move a bit here. And beat the high roller. Then you'll save Bruno, and I swear on my eyes that I'll let you inside my bag. And me and my brother will take you anywhere you want. Anywhere. Okay, sorry. I just had to move my mic and, and sit back and sit more comfortably on my couch. Okay, so idea where she could find more dots for her dice so she fell back to explore right gotten her this far is, which if we're being precise is to a point where she no longer wanted to explore all right look life's complicated sometimes hey what's up with you oh there stranger i've played enough times in my time to see that you could use a friend. I just want to go home. I don't know what I want anymore. Now that's the first step, friend. To not know what I want? Well, what's the second step? Yeah, it was just the uh, lighting making him look different. To figuring out what you do want. There was a time I wanted to get back home too. Back when I traveled the six walls, singing for my supper, and every night as I took in the applause, whether it was there or not, I think this is it. It's time for me to go back home. And every morning I'd get up and go somewhere new and start the whole thing all over again. But now, of course, I figure I didn't actually want to go back home. Yeah, not or else you would have. Anything. Didn't know what real long it was till I came here. Uh, you don't live in Forberg? Ah, oh, heck, I do now. All because of the foreman. He came here and took over right quick. No one could roll a higher number than him. Well, except for Her Majesty, of course. I refused to play for him, and he smashed my fingers up. Oh, goddamn! So I couldn't play for anyone. That but sucks. Yeah, that's no bother. I still remember my songs. They're all right here. 
You see, in my heart. Ah, sorry about your hands. Well, silver linings, friend. Now I can live my days without expectation. Ain't nobody expecting nothing from a man on the street with busted hands. Utterly poetic. Did you know the poor man's a relative of Nanny Fortuna? That's how yeah. come he can keep himself out of jail despite all the heretical dice rolling around here. Does Fortuna make him do those things? <laughs> nah, he is a ruffian, but he is his own man. And well, besides, I'm just sharing a hearsay. Well, would you look at that? I haven't seen one of your kind in years. Quite the charmer, too. But looks like you're a bit worse for wear, if you don't mind me saying. Uh, yeah, Foreman did that. I'm going to find dots and make them better. Uh, he says Nanny's a real uh, unrepentant swamp uh, brain bloop sandwich. I'm going to find the dots and make them better. I have no doubt that you will, stranger. I can see it in your eyes. You're not the kind of girl who lets the world push you around for long. You think all that power would make the four man happy, but I reckon now he's just afraid of losing you. Pretty much. He's turned this whole town into a reflection of that. And yet, in the middle of it all is a small little dark alley where you can be safe and see the world as it truly is. All that power in the world. It don't mean a thing, even next to the people. How do you know my name? The world's got its fair share of horrors, but beauty too. And we just have to do the best we can with the cards we're dealt. I know you'll do good. Answer my question. How do you know my name? You call me Even. How did you know my name? Ah, uh, shucks. An old man like me gets a lucky guess That's... Wow. No, now you don't luckily know. guess a name like Even. Glad you're well, friend. Oh, it was a nice moment of fellowship and kindness in a town that had not shown her much. Even was thankful for that. All right. Well. Oh, what? Cool, superb draw. Uh, luck be a girl. The most generous dice hands out two cards tokens to even. Nice. Let's add that to the deck right away. I think... We might... It might be worth taking out... Hmm. How much was... It, it costs nothing. Yeah. Yeah, no. Uh, yeah, that's worth taking out the Sonic Bloop. That is an amazing card. Dice Maker Square. Okay, so is there anything else in this corner? Yeah, okay. Oh, wow, this is a whole fucking big town that I'm going to get lost in so much. Oh, boy, I am so going to get lost uh, throughout this town. Oh, hey, children. Hey, you want to hear the saddest story in the world? Leave me alone. Uh, uh, sure. Okay, so there's this baby. No, you're telling it wrong. It's not just a baby. It's a duck baby. A duck uh -huh. baby. And the duck baby gets stuck in a hole and gets turned into a spider. And then he dies. That's not sad. Ducks eat spiders. So now he's gonna be duck dinner. That's why he's sad. Ducks don't eat spiders. Wait, do ducks eat spiders? Okay, well, he doesn't know if ducks do or not. So that makes him even sadder still. Yeah, my brother told me this story, and he cried. I then think he told it my wrong. My friend told the story, and I cried. Now we're telling you the story, and you're gonna cry. 
Well, that was interesting. I wonder if uh, the saddest story in the world will be of use to people. Like, I, I traded a word earlier in Two Town. So. Noise. Oh, hey, what's going on here? Oh, jeez, poor Emma. There, there. How can you say that? She... Uh, don't mind me. I'm just looking to get home. What do you need? Our friend, she stopped. Can't even say it. She stopped completely with everyone, she says. Kid, uh, hit your head. What else are you going to do? Life is a game of speculation. Wagering on the, the future holds, speculating on games, on life, on everything. Not speculating on the future. <laughs> insane. Like literally, actually insane. But yeah. Oh, I accidentally skipped a line. You're an innocent kid. She'll listen to you. And we'll pl uh, pay you. With a card. A card you can use. Look, no promises. That's a yes. You're all right, kid. You'll find her hanging around uh, Quadruple Saint Street. I skipped something by accident. All right. Help Emma decide. Okay. To not confuse myself too much, I'm going to try to stay on the boards as long as possible up here cuz okay that's where the kids came from go down there I can go there okay I don't want to go here because that's back on the street so go this way Quarterstone Alley, Foreman's Roulette Area, Dice Maker Square. All right. Yep. No quarter square. Money, money, money. All right. I definitely don't want to go down there. Don't want to go down there. What happens if I hit this button? Okay, you're counting down something, but I can't see what you're counting down. Oh, oh there's another button here. Is that what you were counting down? Am I supposed to press like four buttons or something? I mean, I'm assuming it's four. Because it always seems... Because, I mean, we're, we're, we're in four town. Okay. Oh. Okay, well. And that has to be it, right? Like, those four? Yeah! Shit, I cool! Got one of these things I haven't gotten in a while. Got a achievement called Catapult Slinger. I think there's some people here who don't care about that, Dicey. I think there's some people here who don't care about anything. Nice. 
All right, once again, I'm uh, resuming my adventuring on the top on these boards. So it's just over here. The Queen Street. The yeah, Queen Street is any street she wants it to be. Oh, well, it looks like that's the end of uh, where I can go. All right. So, can't go in there. Vigilante for hire. Freelance police for hire. Raccoon tour for hire. <laughs> okay. Ghost stories lately? You ever seen a ghost? Uh, yeah. I've seen a couple. Perfect. I collect ghost stories, you know. Kind of a premier ghost story collector around here. Okay. The only one too. So, tell me the story of this ghost. My sister, a strange figure. It led me on a journey. I haven't seen it for a while. Chilling. Oh, what happened to the ghost? Why did it disappear? Who was it? Who am I? What are we all even doing here? <laughs> I love it. Wow, he was really easy to impress. Any other spooky stories you let me know? Or if I had three new stories... Okay, how about this story about a duck? For a new ghost tour. I'm gonna... <laughs> Ancient spirits that come out of your head to fight in battles? Right. Not bad, little fella, but come on. I want real ghost stories, not fantasies. Oh, I can pay, too. I'll pay a child for ghost stories. Don't even act like I won't. <laughs> I don't know why that makes me laugh. Okay, find ghost stories. Okay, so where did I come from? I came from this corner. Tell the duck story. Yeah, I'm going to tell the duck story. Heard any good ghost stories lately? Go on. Children are both more likely to see a ghost and more likely to be completely terrified by their encounter. <laughs> I can't wait. It's about a duck. Ah, uh, I, uh, hmm. oh, I see. And? Uh, it got stuck in a hole and cried and it turned into food, but maybe not. It's the saddest thing a kid can imagine. Isn't that sad? Which is good, actually. Okay. Got stuck in a hole and also cried. They, um, you know, die at the end and become a ghost? Yes, absolutely. Huh. Well, that's, uh, well, that is technically a ghost story then. And, uh, well, I I'll say thanks, but, uh, but I don't want to. It was a pretty bad story. See, that ghost story is as disappointing as it is not spooky. Which is to say it is extremely both those things. <laughs> I like this character. Heard any good ghost stories lately? No. Oh, listen. If you come across any other spooky stories, you let me know. Yeah, he's also among the least spooky characters. You're right. <laughs> Just the way he goes about. Okay, so Foreman's uh, Roulette Arena, Quarterstone, Soothsayer Sense. Let's go. I don't know. Let's go this way, I guess. Hey, what's you up with you? Just stand here. Don't you know there's a war going on? Uh, where exactly? Here, in Forburg. The queen's tearing it to pieces. I heard that was uh long ago. The war is over. The war ended, Mister. Wake up! You lost. And the war is over. <laughs> That's rich. If it's really over, then tell me this: How come you have a dad? I'm like the only one here with one. That lies about the war, I might <laughs> Can you tell me about your experience with the war? Ah, I bet you'd like to know. World full of spies. Spies. And I'm not going to tell them anything, you hear? I ain't going to tell them about me or about how the queen showed up one day and Tore Thorberg to shreds looking for shelter. You almost tricked me. But I'm too clever for you, you hear? Too clever by half. Because I've seen what happens when you're not clever. What? Happened to my friend Hades. 
She got in the way of the queen's search. She didn't do anything but be in the wrong place at the wrong time. And that's it. Dunzo. Still hear her wails at night sometimes. She's probably still alive. Hear her in the night, I do. Wailing, not in pain, but confusion. Like she doesn't know she's dead, but can't figure out why she's not living anymore. Huh, wh what? I've never heard her say words once. Got a glimpse of herself in the water. I don't deserve to be here. This took a weird turn. Clear as day. Then she went back to wailing. That's awful. I'm haunted by a ghost too. That's what oh, hey, that's a ghost story. Now run along before you catch a bullet. Kill. Uh, story of war. Okay. All right. So this. So that leads back upwards, which I don't need to go to. Okay, so. Heard any good ghost stories lately? Yeah, uh, from a military man. Oh, war. The source of many, many ghosts. Both dead and living. Oh, appropriate. I just noticed his name is Spooky Steam. It's about his friends. It's about a woman named Pooza. Oh, I smell tragedy. A thing I've learned. Sometimes even more memorable than even the finest victory. What else is it about? It's about how she was killed. It's about how life sometimes is out of your control. It's about how everything good there was lost. I'm going to say the second one. Oh, sounds sad and unfair and very very spooky. Spooky. Oh, I'm not gonna get any sleep tonight. Thank you, kid. Heard any good ghost stories lately? Nope. Oh, listen. You come across. Yeah. Okay. All right. Reward fifty bucks. Okay. So here's where I was earlier. The four horsemen's corner. This leads me back to no quarter square. Okay, good. I'm I'm figuring out my way. I'm basically just trying to go anywhere that I haven't been already. Lost Souls Alley. Four town may have its problems, but it's better than where I came from. It, um, it is better, right? I have no idea. I don't know where you came from. I came here to escape having to work on the upside. Not sure. You don't look like you're from around here. Neither do you. Good eye. I'm from Two Town. I came here to escape having to work on the upside down. Not sure if it was worth it, but <laughs> it's too late now. Uh, for Royam, uh, the bad mayor. I defeated him and arrived. I'd rather not. Yeah, I'm just gonna say. What? I slapped together the mayor's two sides, so Royam's gone. Let's just say I took care of That's the situation. more than double the good news I ever expected. I can't believe this. This is terrific. Finally, some good news in this loathsome ruin of a city crouching beside an even more loathsome, even more ruined city. <laughs> That's right. I never acclimatized to four town. Uh, I get it. One of your personalities is quiet and the other is loud. And loud one is here to celebrate. Woo! I'm going to head back tomorrow. Here, kiddo, take this. Wow, that was... I had use for it, but maybe you will. That was easy. Uh, hey, World Master's Bow. Okay. All right. Well, I came from one town village with my family along with me. And I got trapped here in Forberg Square. No hope for me to see. You want some food, though? I call it Lord Zappy. All right. Only rule here is you gotta be kind. Dice Maker Square. Okay. Oh wait, no, this is Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is over here. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Wait. So I came in to Dice Maker Square. I made this 
turn and then immediately went up. So what I have to do now is just not go upwards. I also saw someone here with a quest marker on it. All right. What are you talking about? I hate gaming. That's right. I said it. I hate gaming. Uh, you're Alma, right? Oh, you must friend of those annoying speculation people over there. <laughs> they spoke to you. Of course they did. All they want me to do is speculate with them. Why are we doing this? What are we trying to prove? Can Asking the good questions. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe I should go back to them. If only to fit in. Ah, oh, look at me. Asking a kid what I should do with my life. But I am asking. What do I do, kid? Go back to speculating on games to fit in? Or give it up and risk being lonely forever? Uh... In a way, life itself is a speculative. Obso uh, obsessing over what may or may not come uh, isn't healthy. Thanks, stranger. You're the only one I've met here who's not addicted to letting chance rule their lives. It's so... random. Well, bye forever! Alright. I've helped Alma... Hey, I got a super elixir. Oh, nice! It tastes like blueberries. Nice. Uh, I'm going to just... This is apparently the... Town of Upgrades... Cause like I got one upgrade of a of my chance of lucky draw into super lucky draw. The elixir changed; it got better. All right. Uh, old four town gauntlet soothsayer's tents. Yeah, what's over here? Lux Crossroad. That's not what the sign said at all. I have a lot of money. I won again? <laughs> oh no! Oh, it's Seymour! What are you doing here? Hey, even! <laughs> Sorry, guys. I, I gotta bounce. <laughs> My friend, it's good to see you. Made it to Forberg, huh? How goes the brave quest? I'm... I'm heading home, Seymour. But I don't see your sister with you. She's... Uh, I, I don't know what I'm doing anymore, Seymour. I'm, st I'm starting to think I don't even know who Odd is. Maybe I never did. Oh! It's a mistake to look up to her. To anyone. We all just... We all disappoint other people, don't we? And here I am disappointing you. Hmm. All right. So you want to go home? Let's start there. You certain about this? No, I'm not certain about anything. I'm not certain about anything. That just tells you you're alive. Life's a roll of the dice, right? It's People okay really are trying to be poetic in this game. It's okay to feel lost or be lost, and to just take things one step at a time. You know your way back. No, but this Ludo Betts guy says he can smuggle me back. I will say this. For a woman who seems so disheartened and pessimistic, you certainly had a lot of success meeting people and securing passage. That's true. If these towns weren't numbered sequentially, I'd be completely lost. Uh, thank the dice makers for their foresight for that, then. Uh, I'd bring you myself, if I could. I'm uh, kind of lost myself. <laughs> Uh, there's a guy who said he could smuggle me. Have you heard of Ludo Betts? One of the Bag Brothers? Yeah, I've met him. Mighty sure of himself, that guy. A little too sure, if you ask me. I heard he gambled away his brother, Bruno. Poor kid. Poor kid. We don't talk about Bruno. Guess. Nope. You need to get his brother back from the High Roller. Yeah, and the High Roller only ever rolled fours. So if you could roll a five... Can you please just repair him? Of course. Pass the little guy over. 
So we just add in the dots he had in two town. And now the extra dots he found back in freedom. And there we go. Well, now he's very uh Seymour restored Dicey to roll threes and upgraded him to roll a four. Yeah. Now you can roll up to oh, um, four, which is still not enough to beat the high roller. Sorry. Yeah. Well, I know where you could find some more dots. Okay. Well, you need to tell me. No, you, no, you need to tell me. Where? Now you have to tell me. I'M DANGEROUS! Oh, is that a threat? I mean, it probably gets you results, but still... Really nom 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 nom! Hi, I see. enjoy the pizza! There's no guarantee of success. Hi, Leo! Hi, YouTube! Yes, indeed! Hi, YouTube! Uh, Seymour? Uh, I eat no guarantee of success for breakfast! I was just gonna say fine, Seymour. Fine, fine. Just don't tell her I'm the one who sent you. Even? Go to the soothsayer tent. And ask about Uma. Very discreet. She's not. She's a name on one of the cards. Just anywhere. And good luck. I'm rooting for you. <clears throat> All right. So All right. Yeah, I want to talk to these folks. How are you doing today, Icy, anyways? I'm sorry, Dicey. Dicey and Icy are close names. Yeah, okay. Alright, so... Quadruple Saint Streets. Wait, where am I going here? Okay. Did I go everywhere? Lux Crossword for, for Queen Street. Soothsayer's Tent. Oh, no, I got turned around, didn't I? Lux Crossroad. Forberg Square. Okay. The fact that it's a square is actually kind of funny. Forberg Square. Ah, Soothsayer Tents. Here we are. Ah, Wandering Soul comes looking for a glimpse at her tomorrow. I'm looking for Uma. Many look for her child, but only a few will ever find her. <laughs> you know where she is. He cannot be reached by those who travel like us. She can only be reached by those who travel like flies. She lives in the sky? No, 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 child. But my tongue is too loose today. Goodbye. And when you find saner goals tomorrow. Ah, now that is the look of someone who wants to know what the future holds. I've got the best fortunes in town. I'm looking for someone named Uma. Uma, that is a surprise. Thought you could see the future. Do you know where she is? I know that you will never find her. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay, that's funny. Much ahead of you. Much ahead indeed. Okay. Can't go in that tent. Uh, I guess I just keep going. 
my fortune. You don't even know what you're do, do you? You have no much. idea. I can shout it all day, and you'll still do exactly what your face is doing. It's not the bar anymore. It's something. I already talked to you. Rugged Rhonda. Let's break this thing. Rug Reader's Domain. What? Ah, oh, you, gentle wanderer. Have you come to know your fortune? I want to find Uma. Uma, so you've heard the stories of the spirit. Tell me everything. All I know is that many years ago, something terrible happened. A mother was hunted by a queen, and in escaping her fate, she disappeared. Some say she still haunts these grounds. You know where I can find her. Some things are beyond even my sight. But only yet, Wanderer, I have not told your fortune. Let me see. Sure, why not? Ah, oh, come closer, child. For you, I see something strange. Voyages in a distant land. Yeah. Journey into random, into darkness. And a queen watches. Yeah, that's... That's been my past, yeah. dog. Your sister, she, she, she does what she's told, and and then the three, their heads, they, <gasps> no. What did you see? No, I oh, don't dare say more. No, too much hangs in the balance, child. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. Please, leave. Wow. Okay. Even you didn't learn much from the fortune tellers. Well, yeah, honestly, I've never cared. For Narrating things before they happen is strictly against the narrator's code. Okay, that's kind of funny. But she nevertheless had the distinct impression that what lay ahead could be dangerous. Yeah, I am making a lot of money. Everyone's been telling me it's dangerous. Greetings, young one. Can I interest you in a delightful new rug? Uh, no thanks. I was wondering if you could direct me to Uma. Step inside, child. So, after this cutscene, it's probably break time? We'll, we'll see. Shows real promise, don't you think? It is just a rug. Don't be so sure, young one. Its threads are woven together in a very unique way. But I have many rugs here. Which ones are you interested in? Does the red one have anything to do with uh, the blue one? Will that lead me to Uma the purple? That's got to have something to do. I'm going to go with blue. The blue one. A fine choice. Oh. There are a pair of best friends in this city. Or rather, there were. Until that friendship was fractured. One of them lives alone near Dice Maker Square. I wonder if uh, could ever be what? restored. Does the red one have to do with that? Ah, them? yes. The red one. Every time I look at that rug, I think of a poor woman here who loves her partner. So okay, so I have to basically do these world, things. Leaving no room in it for herself. Oh, she searches for him near Four Horsemen's Corner. Okay. The purple rug, yes. A personal favorite. You know, the queen, she'd have us believe we're all different. That we need to hate each other. But within us is a light we all share. He is in trouble. In one of the foreman's arenas. All right. So I, if I help these three people, you'll... The future isn't made yet, young one. Weave it to your liking. 
I can tell you nothing else. You want to find Uma, yes? Yeah. Then go and keep your dice friend close. Hmm? Ooh, that strange rug seller seemed to know more than she was letting on. Rug reader. Also, I didn't even know she'd be here, so that's weird and spooky. But for now, Even had little choice but to seek out those people she'd mentioned. All right. And hope that when she'd returned, Uma would be there too. All right. So, don't really have anything else to do except for go back. I don't know, Dicey. It's like this city is a last resort for everyone here. Yep. Well, there was one good thing here, at least. Her dislike of the high roller, making even if more than motivated, find a way to take him down and earn passage and the bag out of here. Okay. So I think with that it's just about time to go back or sorry, time to take a break. Oh. Did I get another cutscene? Oh. Okay. Well, I can do that. Yeah. Game Arena. All right, I'm going to pause that. I'm going to talk to them after the break, but we are going to go ahead and take a little midstream break. It's uh, just about that time. I know I started late, but I still want to take a break uh, around this time here, so just for the sake of, you know, tradition and that kind of stuff. So. Yeah. 